And so that's kind of become my like primary thing is that can I trust your heart? Can I trust your character? Like I, I don't need friends that will not teach me something. I don't need friends that will not discern things. Yeah. I don't need friends that cannot pray. I don't need friends. Like, and I'm not saying that I'm not friends with people with weird characters. I'm not saying, <laughs> I'm saying that there is a level of intimacy that I'm yeah. willing to give depending on the kind of person you actually are. That makes are. sense. Makes that's a lot of I mean. sense. Yeah. And so that's kind of what I look for is like, yeah, that. That's good. That's real good. Like uh, nowadays there is like this, this um I, th I think we talked about it previously you were saying like how like um people want like easy and like uh, i want a soft life mm -hmm. speak to the people who say like man if friendships do doesn't come easy like i don't want it um you know what are the dangers you think that brings that type of mentality brings on one hand i think a friendship should be natural yeah like, I, I do think it should be like, oh, we click. Like, we do vibe over certain stuff. Like, if, if like, y'all are two different people and yeah. there is no type of, like, connection, I ain't saying, like, overcome that. Yeah. <laughs> like, that, that's what I'm not. So I think it should be natural. But I think for a friend, like, I feel like as, as adults, you reach a point where there's a conflict or a, a misunderstanding or a disagreement and when you reach that point that's where the work happens yeah. because now it's beyond what we click about now we're clashing and i have a choice i can work towards us uh getting on good terms again or i could just be like oh no i don't want to talk about this and i shut down and da, 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 da. like when people do that when you don't grow and y'all don't grow together yeah and so that like the people that i've had to work through stuff with work through disagreements with work through misunderstandings there's some there's type of some type of switch where it's like i just i trust you more you have to ask the question you need to sit down with yourself and say is this relationship worth it yeah like like will it does it serve me spiritually? Uh, will it, will it like, like, what does it do for me? And I don't mean in a self-centered way. I mean, like, we need community. We need people in our life. And so we need to be able to think through why we need them, what they, what they add to us. Yeah. But I think one thing that people do not think about is the end of their life. If you have ever sat down with an older person, one thing that they will always describe about their lives is how lonely they are. Mm -hmm. And I think a part of the loneliness that we are preparing ourselves for is that we are unwilling to cultivate friendships that will last us when our spouses die and when our kids leave and when we're in retirement. Like we, we need to be looking at the long game yeah. when it comes to the friends that we build. Facts. And that's what I'm on. I'm on like when I'm 70, 80, who will still be there? Yeah, that's, so, that's good. That's good.